Hey guys, Gizmo here from Teal Gamers and welcome to the Mod Monday. This is our new series that we're gonna be playing just to spice things up on the channel because at the moment we're just gonna have a um, let's play on uh, of The Witcher 3 but we thought that it would be more interesting for you to guys to see some other cool stuff as well. Now this series will not be only about Witcher 3 but it will cover other games as well, the other games that we play. I believe Wazza will make the next episode and he's gonna be covering potentially Pillars of Eternity maybe or maybe of, uh, Armor or GTA 5 depending what is good and what is fun and that's what we're gonna cover basically. To start off the series the first mod that I'm gonna actually cover is gonna be about Witcher 3 and it's called Instant Cast Mod. You will find a link in the description to the mod presets, however the good thing about this is you can set it up yourself and that is also obviously in the mod description there. The cool thing about this mod is that it seems to be future proof which means that if there are any patches coming out it will still work and there's not gonna be any issues for you from it. So what does this mod do? In the vanilla Witcher 3, in order for you to cast a sign, you have to select it first and then you press the Q button to cast it and that can be a little bit of time consuming for you, especially if you are like in the midst of fight and you want to just quickly get over with, you know, with your enemies and you find the old system might be a little bit cumbersome for you or it'd be too much time consuming, so this one would be ideal for you. This mode allows you to cast signs instantly. Basically, by pressing the button, it will cast it straight away without any delays for you. And it works both for the normal signs as well as the advanced ones. So if you hold the button down further, it will cast it straight away. So you don't have to select it first and then cast it. It'll do the whole thing in one go for you. As I mentioned earlier, you'll find the link to the mod in the description there. However, you can set it up yourself and that's what I did myself. And it is actually quite straightforward once you just read the description how to do it and it's not really that difficult. The guy who made this mod has some presets and you're more than welcome to use them. However, I prefer my own setup and to do that it's fairly straightforward. All you have to do is go into your key binding settings, set the keys that you want to represent your signs. Once that is done, exit the game, go into your input setting file, that is in the description as well, and edit that accordingly, save it and you're good to go. As I said, it's awesome because it's future proof and it doesn't seem to break the game even if the new patch comes out so you're safe to just use it and obviously the cool thing about this it will allow you to use the old methods as well so if you don't like the new method you don't if you don't like the instant casting you can just continue using the old ways and it won't do anything to the game Oh, and also, if you're using a controller with a PC and you want that to be enabled for your controller, I believe the mod guy has actually some settings for the controller itself as well. So go check it out and see what you think about it. In my opinion, this mod will improve your combat flow and will make your game even more dynamic than it already is. Obviously, it's entirely up to you guys if you want to go ahead and use it or not. I like it and I am probably going to be using it more often than not. But it would be cool to hear what you guys think about this. So let me know in the description if you've used it, how it is, and if you like it or not. As always guys, thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this and do stay tuned for more. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up guys as it helps with the YouTube ranking. And if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing because we're gonna do more and hopefully we're gonna have more fun. Thanks for watching guys, I'll see you later. This has been Gizmo from TL Gamers. Take care.